Hi Taurus, it's Elle here to do your May mid-monthly reading. Uh, it'll be from today the 16th going into probably June, early June, right? That's the next month. <laughs> Whew. It's like that sometimes. Alright, so I have shuffle and prayed over the cards off camera, but I'll give the cards a quick shuffle and we'll get started. I'm going to do something different. I'm going to do five card spread. The first card is where you are. It's called an advice, advice spread. The first card is where you are. The second card is are you on the correct path? The third is what's the main obstacle? The fourth, what's helping you? And the fifth, how can progress be made? And then I'll pull one clarifier for each card. All right. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm going to put them back. If they come back out, then we know that's what it is. All right. Thank you, thank you, thank you for the messages for Taurus. This first one That's where you are. Are you on the correct path? What's the main obstacle? What's helping you? Okay, and how can progress be made? Okay, I gotta take it. Bottom of the deck, Knight of Swords. Some of you could be dealing with a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, someone who comes in and just they're confrontational. They need to say what they need to say. They don't care how it resonates with you. You, as you are, you're the Queen of Cups, loving, open, warm, a good wife or a good mother. You're nurturing, caring. Um, I don't know if you, you might work in a profession where you have to be those things. Maybe um, hospice, hospital, you have to be hospitable. Um, yeah. Are you on the correct path? Hmm, that that would be kind of a maybe with the Six of Pentacles. Some of you feel like whatever path you're on, whether it's love or um, career, uh, it might not reciprocate or something is unequal here. Or you're putting in too much time and not getting enough money, putting in um, don't have not enough time and not getting enough money. Something is off balance here. The chariot, uh, what is the main obstacle? Could be a Cancerian person, a Cancer, or it might just be that you're not in control. Um, you're not putting yourself first. Cancer is about victory and victory for yourself first. Um, a lot of times, Taurus wants to take everybody they love with them. They care about everybody they love. And the chariot only holds one. It's about getting in control of the light and the dark, the good and the bad. The negative and the positive marrying the two so that you can move forward effortlessly and in victory for self first and then for everyone else you can help uh, what is helping you the king of pentacles this could be another earth sign or this could be you maybe you making solid decisions surrounding your material your career your money your home your stability um, that's what's helping you is okay for some of you I just heard the king of pentacles mindset now your money might not be king of pentacles but your mind is there you're wanting to be the king of pentacles and you're on that road if you get in control of yourself uh, and the things you're doing for self some of you might need some charity here some money or you might be given to a situation a little bit too much when you need to draw in and care about self how can progress be made? Half strength. A Leo could be significant or just this half strength to get through, to move forward, to get in control. Some of you have addictions or dealt with addiction. Some of you, you straddle in the fence there, have a the strength to keep going. Right, the moon, the light and the dark, the moon, what's done at night, you know, uh, what's done in the dark will come to light eventually. The sun will shine. We got the moon here. Um, there's some things unknown to you that's going on, going on, but um, you'll find them out or they'll be revealed. Also, get in control of yourself. Get in control of any habits you may have or any 
inclination to the negative. You know, maybe somebody or something is tempting you. Have the strength to uh, continue down a good path. Whatever good is to you. Okay, one clarifier. Okay. One clarifier for the Queen of Cups, the Queen of Wands. Nice. Some of you Taurus could be dealing with a Queen of Wands and a Queen of Cups. Or Taurus, someone has two women. You know, you're coming up as the Queen of Cups and they have another woman, the Queen of Wands. Seductive, charismatic, um, outgoing, confident, entrepreneur, uh, free spirit. Uh, with the Queen of Wands. Um, are you on your correct path? Ace of Wands in reverse. Yeah, there's no, there's lackluster in what you're doing, whether this is in love or career. Ace of Wands in reverse. There's no passion here. There's no drive. There's no motivation. You're pretty much like a robot. Um, what is the main obstacle? Uh, Eight of Pentacles chariot you're not putting work into yourself you're not putting work into your craft you're not wanting to perfect things so that you can move forward in victory and effortlessly um put the work in do the work eight of pentacles work on yourself firstly too um this could also be exercise plan too um for some of you cards that fell all right and what is helping you the king of pentacles that king of pentacles mindset is helping you what is helping you okay uh the high priestess in reverse came out you're not using your intuition around practical matters yes you need to be practical you need to be logical if you only have $500 in the bank, no, you don't need to buy a $300 pair of shoes. Granted, uh, that's practicality, but um, something's asking you to, to look within, look deep. You're being a little too practical. And you were holding on to things, secrets, you know, your own little plans and your own little um, philosophies about things in life. Now you might be revealing them or some things might be revealed to you that will help you on this path to be more practical to becoming like the King of Pentacles. These two flipped over. How can progress be made? Have strength. Understand that there's some things you don't know. And then the high priestess is in reverse with the moon up, right? Eight of wands, ten of cups. Wow. Okay, so the things that you don't know. Spirit working in the background. You letting go of... The high priestess has control because she has higher knowledge. You letting go of that control aspect will bring you to some fast movement to a happy ending or just an overall happy state with the ten of cups it's like some secrets get, get revealed you say something or someone says something to you it all makes sense it's like an aha moment and then you can move forward and be at the ultimate level of happiness this is resonating with you Taurus please take advantage of the $15 reading um, go over to my website all the information is below you can book online pay online what's the support and energy for Taurus three cards of support for Taurus three cards of support for Taurus Self-employment. Okay. Gracefully aging. Nice. Oh, crap, crap, crap. 
this one fell retirement nice and then upright is take the next step and new exercise program and I think we talked about that with that chariot and the eight of pentacles in reverse you're not exercising you're not you're getting comfortable don't get too comfortable to us. you never know self-employment gracefully aging retirement something comes in something is working behind the scenes for you in, in the midst of self-employment or there's just lackluster here some of you feel like you're doing a lot of work and not getting enough gain some of you are contemplating self-employment or what you're going to do for retirement or contemplating working smarter and not harder because this also talks about a, re a reduction in the amount of hours you put into your work gracefully aging definitely with this chariot and the eight of pentacles work on yourself care for self start a new beauty regimen man or woman um, put some energy into yourself here If you're contemplating self-employment, there's two self-employment cards. Retirement also talks about a different form of employment and then self-employment. It's highlighted for you. Some of you are definitely contemplating it. Something comes in and it takes you to a place of King of Pentacles again. Yeah. Some information is revealed. It's like you have an aha moment in regards to what you need to be doing or how you could be doing it. And it happens fast because you get some, some rapid communication. Um, and it takes you to the King of Pentacles again. Whatever this is. I'm so nosy. Temperance in reverse. The Hermit in reverse. Knight of Cups in reverse. Four of Wands in reverse. Four of Cups in reverse. Oh, wow. I think for some of you, you learn, you've learned about somebody being unfaithful, some infidelity, some lies, some deception, even some theft. And then you just completely cut this person out. That's what comes out. And here is self-employment. All right, Taurus, contact me for a personal reader so we can figure this out together. All right, um, everything looks good. Um, take care. I'm praying for you. Pray for me as well. Remember, when in doubt, pray. All of the information of how to get in contact with me, my email, the web address, the website, all of that is below. Um, like, share, comment, subscribe. Click that subscribe button, all right? Uh, all um, participation with this channel is much appreciated, all right? Take care. I'll see you in your June readings.